What up everybody, it's Nick from Main Name Custom Prints and today I'm gonna show you what cut settings I use for my Cameo 4 Plus for heat transfer vinyl. So I use Thermoflex Plus. I also use a couple of other brands that they sell around locally here. Um, McLogan's in LA sells uh, Revolution, I think, and Print and Supply Warehouse in Long Beach sells Results, it's called Results. Um, the cut settings I'm gonna use today is for Revolution and Thermoflex. I use Thermoflex the most. That's the vinyl I always buy. But I'm gonna show you the cut settings for that. So put your vinyl on the mat, just load up the mat. And every time I test out a cut, um, I like to use scrap vinyl. This is a scrap. I don't just throw in the roll and then cut and then cut and then cut just to see what goes right now. I use the scrap so I don't lose anything. So you load it up. What I suggest, if you're new to the cameo, because this happened to me a couple times, the cut, the test cut happens all the way out here. So you have to line up your vinyl all the way out here. Um, I'm new to this. I came from Cricut. So my thing was line it up right at the edge. And I did, and it will cut my mat. It will cut some of the mat and it will cut some of the vinyl. So if you're new to the cameo, line it up all the way to that line. Now we load up our mat. And if for some, somehow you could change that. I don't know how, if somebody knows how, let me know. Load up the mat. All right, so let's go to the computer now. I'm gonna move you guys and see if um, you guys can see it. Silhouette Studio, you go to send. Silhouette Studio has pre-made settings already. And for heat transfer vinyl, you're supposed to go to heat transfer smooth. Um, I personally do not like this setting. The regular setting for this is the blade at two, the force at four, and the speed at eight. That did not work for me. It'll do the test cut, but once you cut a whole design with detail and all of that, it's not gonna cut it good, trust me. But what you can do is test the cut, um, see how it cuts out. If you don't like it, you could edit here. You go, so let's say you wanna go to move it to three. You move it to blade three. You wanna move the force up, move the force up. Um, speed, slow it down, speed it up. And then see what works for you. So I already have my um, pre, I already did my custom settings and I have it labeled as Thermoflex slash Revolution HTV. So that's what works for me. And I have the blade at three, the force at seven, and the speed at eight. Now, if I have if I have a really detailed design, um, I'll bring the speed down a little bit, but this is what works for me. So let's test it out. Okay, so it did the test cut. I don't know if you guys can see, that's the backside. I like to be able to see the the cut through the other end, not enough to where it cut because I cannot feel it on the other side, but I could see it and then right there. So let's weed it. So for the test cut, all the Cameo does is cut a triangle and a square. So it cut a square and then a triangle in the middle and that weeded perfectly. No sticking, no nothing, it cut perfectly. So those are my cut settings for Thermoflex Plus and also Revolution. They work perfectly fine. That's for regular HTV, not glitter, not uh, foils, none of that, just regular HTV. If you wanna change your settings on the, on the computer, you come to your computer, you go here to more. Let's say you found your settings or whatever, you go to more, you click add, you name it whatever you want. I'm gonna name it test. Okay, so now what kind of material is it? Okay, it's heat transfer vinyl. Okay, so now you click here plus and you're gonna choose carriage one. I'm not really 100% sure, but I assume that means what um, blade thing you're using because um, the camera has two blade or two sockets to put tools in. This one has a one, this one has a, a two. So you choose one and then from here is where you edit your, your settings. The force, put it, it was seven, speed, eight, passes, and I assume that means acceleration. 
I leave that alone. I don't move that. And then the blade depth, you move it here. You can go two, one, one, two, three, four, five, whatever you want. I had it at um three, so let's go to three. And then you're gonna click save. And then it's gonna ask you, would you like to copy your carriage one settings to your legacy cut settings? What does that mean? I honestly have no idea, but I always put yes. So let's put yes. And there you go, that's your new cut settings. So now let's say I go to heat transfer smooth. You see the cut settings are two, four, and eight. Now, if I go to the ones I just did, which is test, it changes to three, seven, and eight. So those are my cut settings for the Cameo 4 for Thermoflex Plus um, HTV. I hope this helped you out because I know when I started, I was all over YouTube looking for fucking cut settings specific for this vinyl. If you guys have any questions, leave them in the comments. Like this video, subscribe, uh, follow us on Instagram. And yeah, that's it. Peace, I'm out.